Am I the asshole? For telling my sister she can't be a scapegoat because she was actually a piece of shit. I have an older sister Jen 28F and a younger sister Chloe 17F. Jen made our lives a living hell. She was rude, reckless, a liar, a thief, everything. She refused to go to therapy and fought our mum every step of the way. None of us could have nice things because Jen would ruin them all the moment. She got into a screaming match with Chloe when she was 11 and Jen was 22. There's so much more she's done but it's very personal. She was a bad person. Full stop. When she was 24, she met her current boyfriend who is a literal godsend. Jen finally went to therapy, got a degree and has a job. She's not perfect, but I can acknowledge the effort, as much as I dislike her. Over the past few months, she's been making an effort to reconnect with the family. Chloe is full North Carolina but me and mum have been seeing her. I feel like she's been lying to her therapist because she's been told she was the scapegoat, I was the invisible child and Chloe was the golden child. This couldn't be further from the truth. I will admit, at the height of Jen's spiral, mum did assume everything bad was caused by Jen, but that was because it had been years of the same destructive pattern of behavior. Like, yes Jen, you're an alcoholic, of course she's going to assume it was you who stole her booze. Or assuming she got fired from her job due to her attitude which is why she got fired from every job beforehand. Or assuming she was being brought home by the police because she regularly breaks the law. This was never mum being malicious, but when that's what you've come to expect over nearly 10 years, you're going to make a snap judgment. Jen and her fiancé Luke met with me to have coffee and she brought this up and I'll admit, I laughed in her face. She asked what was wrong and I said scapegoat. Seriously? Jen, I'm glad you're getting better but you were a piece of shit growing up. She got really upset and said she was trying to reach out. I said I appreciated it but she has to acknowledge how much hurt she caused everyone. She ended up storming out and sent me a text saying she's not going to be disrespected like that and that it took her years to realize the family's dynamic. Am I the asshole? Edit Some people have asked me how I know Jen is lying why I was so dismissive of her. Here's why her assessment of the siblings dynamic golden, invisible and scapegoat child do not line up at all. I am apparently the invisible child which could not be further from the truth. The same goes with Chloe, who Jen labeled the golden child. I'm looking at examples traits of all three syndromes and none of them line up. I also want to make it clear that Jen assigned these labels to us, not her therapist. I've learned that respectable therapists don't use terms like these so my best guess is Jen has pulled this out her ass whilst we were meeting, or her therapist reinforced it. Either way, Jen came up with this alignment which makes me skeptical of her.